Field will stay tightened up. We'll work through corners three and four. Billy Abbey will lead us out of corner number four for the stock cars. Working down into corners one and two. Taylor on the outside of Abbey. Taking them still side by side down the back straightaway. Here comes the 05. Drive on the outside is Taylor. He'll back it down. Here comes Whiting looking for that second spot. Taylor now looking to lead lap number one. The 05 has it as he works down the front straightaway. Whiting is scored in spot number two. Put your pull center back to third. Stock car staying grouped together as Taylor continues to lead down the back straightaway. Whiting has settled in the spot number two in that 16W. Hold on to it, Whiting out of corner number four. Stacking them up. Whiting a little crossed up. Had to gather that thing up. Around goes the 7-Eleven of Billy Abbey. Around goes Mike Earl. Caution flag is out. Two laps complete, 20 laps the distance here for your IMCA Sunoco stock cars. Gonna fire them back off out of corner number four. Underway for your stock cars. Bellum quickly goes by Whiting for spot number two. Here comes Travis DeMille on the outside. He has a 5D car wound up. Trouble for Kyle Clough. Clough slows down the back straightaway. Clough pulls it to the infield, will stay green. Single file now, DeMille working on the back bumper of Whiting, 16 machine. Down the back straightaway. Taylor continues to lead Bellum second, Whiting third. Tough break for Kyle Clough, finds himself in the infield. Single file are your IMCA stock cars. Taylor is about a half a straightaway advantage over Joe Bellum. Bellum able to close the gap that time through corners three and four as Taylor continues to lead. Closest battle on the track will be that third spot. Travis DeMille on the back bump row. Whiting look to the inside. Whiting shuts the door. They work out at corner number two. DeMille back to work. Settles in behind Whiting. Battle still for that third spot. DeMilt searching, trying to find a line to get by that 16 car. Billy Abbey rounds out the top five. He'll go to the inside of DeMilt. Battle for that fourth spot. Billy Abbey now into the fourth spot. Fourth and fifth change positions at last lap. On the inside, DeMilt fires back to the inside of Billy Abbey. Travis DeMilt trying to get that spot back in that 5D. Taylor extends that lead a couple more car lengths. That time out of corner number two. Taylor committed to the low side of the racetrack. Continuing to click off laps here at Phillips County Raceway. Trouble for Travis DeMilt pulls into the infield. Will stay green. Jeff Whiting trying to catch that 73 car. Joe Bellum, that's the closest battle on the racetrack. Taylor continues to lead. Whiting and Bellum both trying to run down your race leader, Jesse Taylor, in that center chassis. Jesse Taylor of Fort Morgan, Colorado, builds those cars himself. He's got the 05 hooked up here tonight, looking to win back-to-back -back weekends. Feature winner last weekend at Lincoln County Speedway in North Platte, Nebraska. Trying to double down here at Phillips County Raceway. Opening weekend, Taylor led most of the second night before breaking a transmission out of corner number four. Still single file front to back. Joe Bellum starting to fight a tight race car has allowed Jeff Whiting to catch up to that 73 car down the front straightaway. 
Little smoke as well from Joe Bellum's ride. Taylor still working that low groove of the racetrack. He is hooked up on the low side here at Phillips County Raceway. Out on a Friday night cruise here at Phillips County Raceway. Bellum still in second, Whiting trying to run down that 73 car. He's got just about to the back bumper again. Bellum shoves the nose, leaves the door open out of corner number four. Jeff Whiting now to the inside. Side by side down the front straightaway. Whiting will drive it in deep, little contact. Whiting into the side of Bellum, trying to take over that second spot. Here comes Whiting. Whiting trying to clear the 73 car. Bellum will back off, go back to the inside. And he'll now have to go back to work on Whiting's machine. Five laps to go this time by for your race leader, Jesse Taylor. Joe Bellum has slowed in that 73 car. Did see some smoke a couple laps ago as he came down the front straightaway, trying to work on Whiting, trying to reel the 16 car back in. Out of four, Bellum chasing Whiting. They'll sail it off into corners one and two. Race leader Taylor, he's working down the back straightaway. Almost a full straightaway advantage now for the 05 of Taylor. Here comes your race leader. He works out of corner number four. Whiting still second, Bellum third. Abby rounds out. That fourth spot, Mike Girl still running fifth rounds out your top five. Whiting able to pull a little bit away from Joe Bellum. IMCA Sunoco, stock cars. Laps winding down here as Taylor continues to lead. Down the back straightaway to corner three and four, Jesse Taylor. Shows away here tonight. He'll exit corner number four. He'll grab the white flag this time by. One more time around for your race leader, Jesse Taylor. Whiting second, Bellum third, Jesse Taylor down the back straightaway for the 20th and final time. And the driver out of Fort Morgan, Colorado, trying to go back to back weekends in his IMCA stock car. Will exit corner number four to the checkered flag, one in the IMCA Sunoco stock cars. Feature here tonight at Phillips County Raceway. Jeff Whiting second and Joe Bellum rounds out the top three.